What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Rock Soldier and today we're going to be reacting to 21 Pilots at the Risk of Feeling Dumb. Official music video, man. Super excited to check this one out, guys. We're going to hop right into it. Let's get it. Now, this is one based off the title I thought should have been off their self-titled album. Backflips there in this song, that's for sure. Used to be you and me, matching Kawasaki Z's, right around 270 in Kawasaki T's. Two fighter jets matching energy, trying to forget that we're in ejection seats. So please, keep in mind, check on. That's fucking clean. I like that, man. I like that. Yeah, I mean... Oh, man. Wow. How do you just take, like, a title and just, like, able to... Put so many meanings into it, man. Okay, so... Yeah, I mean, I feel like there's two sides to this, right? At the risk of feeling dumb. Um, all right, so we'll, we'll talk it from the, from, the, from the point of view of the... I don't want anyone know me or not to see me at my lowest, right? So we'll talk to, in the point of view of someone who's actually going through it, right? You know, the, they don't want anyone to to see them at their lowest because you know they don't want to feel dumb. They want to. They don't want to feel like, you know, that they're bothering other people. That that they're the one in in need of help. That they're the ones who need saving and stuff. Like they don't want to be that burden on people, right? They don't. They don't want to have that that feeling, you know, at the risk of feeling dumb. That's why they don't want people to know, right? Um, and then from from the other point of view, right? From say, from like a, a concerned friend standpoint, you know, sometimes you don't want to, you know, maybe 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 you get a little uncomfortable or a little worried about asking your friend or checking on your friend in that kind of way because you don't want it to become something, you know. You know, maybe 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 you maybe you ask that question and and then they take it as like a, a you know what the hell you know why would you even say that I mean, of course I'm doing fine like how dare you type thing you know so you know, there's kind of that risk of feeling dumb there too uh, I guess is what I'm kind of is, is what I'm saying man and so like wow I mean the way to just have it like just both there wow like just the, the both sides of it in the title. I like the change of pace here and the different drops. Wow, there was a lot in that second verse that I just feel like like there was just a lot loaded in there and that took like a much more serious turn uh than than maybe what I was expecting, like serious and like specific turn, right? I mean I don't know how to feel, man, about you sleeping so close to a weapon you conceal, man. Those night terrors are not something to take lightly. I know that it's a risk saying this. Don't fight me. I, I mean, like, and that, and that is the risk, right? Is, is is trying to kind of have that honest conversation from a from a concerned friend standpoint. You know, you kind of you kind of do risk that a little bit. But I think, like he said, it's 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 worth it's worth it. It's worth the risk, right? Like trying, you know, even if they get upset. 
I think hopefully over time, you know, they'll come to see that like you were just trying to be there for them and just trying to check in, you know, and make sure that they're good, you know, type thing. And I think that's that's uh, you know, much more. I think that that's a much better thing to do and much better thing to have to deal with than having to deal with, you know, losing a friend completely. Um, and I don't mean you know necessarily just in like a friendship, but you know, like you know, life and death type of thing. So, um. Yeah, man, I, I I feel like you know there there's a lot there to both sides there. Um, at the risk of feeling dumb, I mean, like I, you know, I didn't think you would be able to literally kind of just take one line and kind of have it be so meaningful to both sides of this kind of conversation on this topic. But like, yeah, I mean, I feel like that 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 risk of feeling dumb from both point of views, man, is is like a very real thing. <laughs> That's what the that's what the wristbands say from the listening party. I've been wondering this whole time what the hell those wristbands are for. <laughs> All right, so that was at the risk of feeling dumb. Uh, Twenty one pilots, man, and you know I, I said it there very fast at the beginning, but the music kind of came in quickly. Uh, was that you know based off the title that this felt like one that should have been off their self titled album, uh, you know way back when, and I think that was a kind of an accurate statement. Um, yeah, like this, this, like this topic, um, and and just kind of like the the, the thought outness of it and the way it was told and explained just definitely felt like something off their self titled album, you know. Um, and I freaking I I love that. I mean that they were able to go back and kind of capture that. I, I don't know if I'd necessarily say that the that the sound of the song was you know was was from that period. But I, you know, I certainly think the the meaning and, and the way the lyrics were constructed uh, definitely were, um, and and I love that he was able to kind of just again just capture both sides of that topic so well with just with just that one line at the risk of feeling dumb, you know, because I think that really is a, like a very real uh, thing from from both perspectives, you know, like you know at the end of the day. You know, you, you know, check in on your friends, like he said, man. I mean, check in on the people closest to you because you just never know. You know, I'd much rather have, you know, my family members or my close friends, you know, pissed off at me for a little while uh, than to think that, you know, no one's really there for them and, you know, that they don't really have anyone, you know, close that they can really confide in and something like that. You know, I'd much rather, I'd much rather deal with them being upset with me than, than uh, being gone forever. So, you know, I think the importance of this song... Um, I mean, not importance, but the relatability uh, of this song um, is is huge, and I think the the fact again that, that the way they were able to tell this and and talk about this topic really reminded me of some of their old work, and I think that's just freaking awesome that they were able to take that and kind of put it into into uh, you know today's world, so to speak. So overall, I enjoyed this one, and hopefully you guys, you guys did as well. If you did, please make sure to leave a like, hit that sub button, and hit that bell button, and we drop on the next one. That is all I got for you guys for now. It's your boy, Rock Soldier. Hope you have a great rest of your night. Even better tomorrow. And I'll talk to you in the next one, guys. Peace.